Hello everybody and welcome back to Against the Lads and it is time for another super cool Cards the Universe and Everything deck review and this deck is amazing you're going to love it it's the Evil Turtle League deck I can guarantee you are going to love this deck anyhow just before just want to let you know on the update I'm trying to get every single card I only need 18 cards now and there they all are all those grayed out cards they are the only card so if anybody does want to help me out i am dad of the goat in game do have me as a friend i will be extremely extremely grateful it's my easter mission to try and get every single card or try and get nearly every single card um because i would keep releasing cards every two minutes but anyhow 18 cards if you do want to do a fair trade do look me up in game do make me offer. I've got millions and millions and millions of cool cards up for trade. But I will be extremely grateful. I'll just quickly flick through. Steamboat Willie is one I really want. And Lone Cypress. Two more cards before we move on to this cool league deck. And that's the last one. Cottage Core. I think that's a new card. Okay, here we go. Let's go and check out the Evil Turtle League deck. There we go. Deck code is NF6PU5. Let's go through it. It is a world turtle deck. No surprise, the evil turtle. And it's a 4, 4, 4, 4, and then two extra cards at the end. And it is good as long as you play it in the right order. That's the main thing. And I'm going to show you how to do that through the game that we're going to play in a minute in this week's league. So first card up, one of my cute old favorites, Pika. Uh, 5 to 25, a legendary card, this one. On the play, your opponent's cards in hand lose 7 permanently. And this card gains plus 35 permanently. Here we go. A bit of evilness. Cockatrice. Nice one. You should know that card. Then we've got Praying Mantis. Again, with this one, make sure you try and get that rotation right on the draw. If you're losing the round, two opponents, random cards in hand, lock this round. And what I try and do is play Hippocrates. Uh, where are we? There he is in the middle there. I couldn't find him. Actually, I'm just going to show you. I'll go through the deck first and then I'll show you as we play the deck, the tactics with this deck. Next one up is that World Evil Turtle deck uh, on the play of your deck. is exactly four arts and culture cards, which we do. Your arts and culture cards, wherever they are, gain 14 until played. Repeat for each album. A mega card. Don't see him being used very often anymore, but he is a good card. Then I've got three tarot cards. First one is the Ace of Cups. Uh, four for 40, and I'm keeping all the energy costs quite low because I have got Bobby in this deck. Uh, which is why I've gone with this one. On the play, your cards adjacent to this game plus 20 permanently. On the return, your cards adjacent to this cost plus one permanently. It's 220 starting energy this week and no energy per turn. So we've got loads of energy to play with. This deck works really well. The hero front at six for 47. On the play of your deck is exactly three tarot cards, which we do give them wherever they are 27 permanently. That's going to help us build up our score. Ace of Swords, another evil card, 7 for 20. I love this one. Uh, if played in the left, your cards in hand gain 25 until played. But my preferred option with this deck, if you played it in the right, your opponent's cards in hand lose minus 25 until played. Very good. Give them a round of applause. <laughs> Next one up is Ghost. Put him in, really. You probably might not need him, actually, but I've needed him a couple of times just to keep my energy levels up. But 3 for 26, uh, gain plus 1 permanently. And if you lost the turn, gain at plus 1 permanently. Uh, he is good. And you'll see why we put him in later on as well. Uh, here we go. One of my all-time favourites again. Wetsuit. Uh, 4 for 38. So he's cheap to play. On the draw, your Ice Fish, which we've got. And your Blood Circulation card, which we've got. Wherever they are, gain plus 68 until play. That is really cool. Especially when you're playing a Bobbit deck. Uh, blood circulation there is that one of those cards it's only two for 15 but once you play wetsuit he is going to be a super powerful card and on the return if you lost the turn this card gains plus 15 permanently here is hypocrites hypocrites three for zero on the play lose 80 this turn that's not very nice uh, but try and play him you need to target three rounds with this deck so target him on the last turn of one of the rounds you're trying to lose and then you will start off with 140 points on the return at the beginning of the next round a very good tactic door to hell just to give us a bit of power three for 40 again he won't get hit by bobbit on the draw your cards in hand burn 50 until played and gain plus 50 at this turn very nice i do expect to be behind 
and we're going to use the flying dutch spoon with a few little sneaky tactics six for 30 if you're losing the round which we should be when we play this card your cards in hand gain plus 48 this turn if you're winning the round your plundering pirates haven't got any of them wherever they are would gain 36 for two turns here is that amazing card bobby worm i am going to show you why i still think bobby worm is one of the best limited legendaries in the game he is getting better and better uh, on the return all cards wherever they are with 50 or more base power lose minus 25 until played week like this is working out he is going to knock off your opponent probably 350 maybe even 400 points across their deck that is a massive massive advantage for you that's bobbit worm and if you pair it up with this beauty four for 40 a fusion sea sheep on the play your opponent's cards in hand with 41 or more base power lose minus 30 this turn that will make them cry really evil ice fish great card this one especially when there's an arena bonus uh five for 44 on the draw your cards wherever they are gain plus seven for two turns and your opponent's cards in hand lose minus seven for two turns repeat if your deck contains that blood circulation which it does so we are going to get 14 points on our card 14 power and our opponent's going to lose 14 at power for two turns absolutely amazing that evil little ice fish and then a couple more evil cars or one more evil car uh paleontology card arthur pluria on the play your opponent's cards in hand with 45 or more base power lose minus 30 this turn and next and then the last one again to play strategically when we're trying to win a round test studio formation you should know that one okay here we go let's go and check out that evil turtle league deck see what we can do here we're only right two but i'm getting ready for my easter holidays i am going to scotland Yoo so i cannot wait well unfortunately i'm taking all of the family with me <laughs> so there we go never mind okay here we go we are playing san leon san leon i'm getting dirty looks now oh dear <laughs> okay here we go uh let's do this deck i'll explain it as we go through <clears throat> what is he playing let's have a look oh it's a space deck is it going to be one of those space technologies or one of those cool rocket decks so let's get world turtle pika and bob it out that's a beautiful start for us one eight three world turtle is going to buff all our cards oh definitely a space deck <laughs> i can see it's a space deck we're a little bit behind but i am not worried we are going to do some serious damage and we are also going to lock up some of his cards be amazing if we get praying mantis now but that's probably too oh, oh, oh what a wish that's my easter wish gone so, okay we just locked up two of his cards and praying mantis now we are in an awesome Let's look at that four five five door to hell and the flying dutch because we are behind that's gonna put us in the lead and he's got two cards locked up until the end of the round oh well done praying mantis and now normally I would play Hippocrates because normally I would lose the first round, but I'm not going to do it this time because we've got a chance to win. So our only option are those two. Two, six, one. Ooh, 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 that's going to be close, but no. Oh my word. I wasn't expecting to win at that first round. That is amazing. Well done, Evil Turtle and Bobbit. We have to give Bobbit credit, really. Okay, let's go now we can probably let's go for it a little bit what have we got i guess we should get tessudo out let's see how we do uh ace of cups that one goes in the middle don't forget four for 95 at the moment and i think i'm going to play ghost one at six three actually let's just swap that round i'm going to hold tessudo because i'm probably going to try and lose this round and show you what i mean because we don't want to get too greedy so this deck like i said it's about winning three rounds and losing two rounds and making sure you get your cars in the perfect order so what we're going to do on turn three uh we are going to play hippocrats so we will lose that 80 but gain 140 for the first turn of round three and let's see what should we do here oh it's a little bit early but let's play him anyhow i'm going to play him in the right hand slot we're going to do some big damage this will be funny we're going to obliterate your card san leon oh that is good that is the power of this deck <laughs> he manages to get 285 still that's a good score that is a great rocket deck by the way it's a space rocket deck uh i'm gonna do a video on that i've been playing a space rocket deck it's pretty good um, but this deck is much more fun 
Oh, now we are looking good. So Hippocrates at the end, Cockatrice to lock up another one, and World Turtle, and keeping that test judo. Oh, that is so good for us. So we are 1-1, one, one, but we are going to be starting off with one of his card lock for three turns and 140 points in the bank. Very nice indeed. So that is the tactic. Now we can play test judo because we've got a nice bit of a lead. Uh, although praying mantis is coming around we don't want to go too crazy so we kind of want to lose this round oh sorry this turn um but get a good score anyhow four one seven oh that's as low as i can go that's a bit high oh what's he gonna get come on beat me another buff another buff go on keep going Oh, 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 he beat me by one. That's his second Easter wish. I am using up all my Easter wishes here. That is perfect. Oh, uh, we wanted to be behind. The reason we want to be behind is so we can get the pick the praying mantis. Boom, here he goes. <laughs> Free card lock. And also so we can play flying Dutch. That is the tactic with this deck. Oh, that was so, so lucky. One point. What should we do? Ice fish or Pika? Uh Pika, let's do a bit more damage to his cards. 501. Oh, and he can only play two cards. We should be alright on this round now. So it's gonna be all down to round of five, I believe. We're only 181 in the lead, but his cards are still locked. And we've got some good scoring cards. There's that ace of cups. We can do some real damage now to his cards. This would be nice. And that ice fish will take use of the arena bonus. Oh, it's not an arena bonus, actually, is he? The wrong type of fish. I mean, he does get a bonus, but not the bonus I thought. Five, four, five. Let's just do some cool. Oh, where are we? Six, eight, four. Oh, that was nice. San Leon. Sorry about that. You've got a beautiful deck. But that evil turtle is absolutely destroying you. Okay, we now still got our cards in a really good order. Uh, too good, actually. Uh, I want two good cards to come right at the end. So after Paul and Sea Sheep to do some damage at the very end of round five. So that's why I played those two first. And then really Ghost, it doesn't matter. Um, we've got 78. He's down to 64. He's got to get through this round. and He's got to get through the next round. We'll be all right on 78 because we're getting four per round. He's not getting any extra energy. He's going to be tight on energy as well. Rockets are quite expensive, so we can buff up with World Turtle. I'm going to hold Cockatrice until the end, I think. Uh, Ace of Swords, let's keep that one. Wetsuit and Blood Circulation, 258. So we're playing, we're keeping those two cards there because they're best played right at the very end of this round. And I think we should get Hippocrates. Is it Hippocrates or Hippocrats? Hippo, I'm going to call you. Eight five six behind, but never mind. We did want he's got 49 energy. Keep an eye on his energy. Yeah, there's Hippo. Uh let's see. So we definitely want to play Hippo. Uh Ace of Swords. I might keep that one. Probably want to play Bobbit Cockatrice to lock up. No, let's get Door to Hell out of the way. Maybe Bobbit would have been a better bet, but he's worth a few more points, and we do need to win the fifth round. Should we go with Bobbit? Let's swap them around, actually. Let's do that. Do some damage. That's better. <clears throat> okay, I'm happy with that move, actually. Making sure that we get the 150 and lock up one of his cards. So now playing Cockatrice there means one of his three cards that he held. And I think he was trying to hold his three big space cards. We've locked one up now until the end of the game. And if we can try and get behind on the first turn, Praymans is going to lock up another couple of cards. <laughs> Okay, so we have got good condition here. Test Judo, Bobbit, and uh, yeah, we want to lose this. 195. You can play three cards. That's a shame because Prey Mattis is going to lock up the two cards that are locked up. But never mind, we're still. Oh, oh, hang on. What's he doing? Playing. Oh, he's shuffling around. Oh, he's only playing two. But, oh, that was a good move. Is he going to... Oh, no. Minus 40. San Leon. Oh, I think he made a boo-boo there. I don't think it matters anyhow. He's going to run out of energy, if nothing else. He's got 28 left. 
you can only play three cards. Unfortunately, that was worked out a good move for him because we would have locked up another card, but never mind. So Flying Dutch and Playing Mantis out the game, but we've still got a nice 5-1-6. He's still going for it, 4 2 We've got a nice lead. We've got a very nice lead going into the final turn. And what have we got coming? We have got some good points coming. He did quite well actually there. My tactic was to lose that first turn. Uh, but here we go. Sea Sheep and Arthropura to do that damage. So we kept those in the right order. Oh, and he could only play two cards at the end there. And we are going to destroy both of them. There we go, guys. That is such a cool evil deck. The Evil Turtle League deck. NF6PU5. Do try and make that deck. There's a couple of cards you can swap around. But it works really, really well. Nice balance of evilness uh, and Bobbit. Uh, really working well there. Anyhow, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, we'll be back very soon with a load of cool Easter stuff. But in the meantime, have fun, take care, and look out, look out for the special Easter egg redeem code coming soon. Bye!